with one of the main men behind the mission here of the Artist Institute, Maxence Bradley. He's the director of the Cine Institute. Maxence, thanks for joining us. Welcome. Now, I know you have a heavy daily itinerary <laughs> here at the Institute, so I really appreciate you taking time out for us. Uh, tell us about the Cine Institute and the curriculum that you offer here. Uh, we are the Cine Institute, the only film school in Haiti. Uh, we have a two years program, uh, around 60 students uh, engaged for a 40 hours curriculum, uh, intense filmmaking classes, ethic classes, English classes, uh, photography classes uh, for two years. So. Wow. Well. Wow, now that's a lot. Yeah. I know each <laughs> each program in itself probably has layers and levels to it. Um, walk us through the process of how students are accepted or selected for the program here. Uh, we open submission uh, for students uh, once a year, so they can apply and uh, we, we do some interview. We ask for portfolio, so for, uh, for any experience r related to uh, to cinema, but also we are open to, to uh, choose some students that have a cultural background, maybe in theater, in dance. Mm -hmm. uh, we are looking for a, a future generation of artists in general, mm -hmm. and uh, if you have some film experience, it's even better. Now, what I love about this uh, this institute is that your students are all funded by scholarships. Absolutely. Can you give us a little background about that? Uh, yeah, uh, we, we we used to say that if you're if you're choosing to, to take part of the curriculum, you have a grant. Your your uh, two year study are are, are granted. Mm -hmm. So we want you to to put maximum of yourself into your your studies. We want you to to focus on. on the film that you're going to do, on the mm -hmm. things that you're going to learn, and we want uh, full involvement for two years. And of course a scholarship allows a student to really focus and appreciate what they're learning, mm -hmm. so there's no time wasted at all. Exactly. So give us the experience of a student here that's at the Cine Institute. What, what happens from the beginning of the year to the end of the year or the semester? Uh, first, we have uh, in first year our 10 gold film, a uh, film made with practically nothing. Uh, one, two, three characters. They're learning how to tell a simple story uh, with simple, uh, s s simple gear. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, more the curriculum uh, uh, advanced, mm -hmm. more complicated uh, the, the film gets. Mm -hmm. So um, at the end of a two year program, you, you are able to do a, a nice fiction short film. Uh, and to know how to promote it, or a, a nice 10, 15 minute documentary. We also have a focus on music video because mm -hmm. it's very popular in the country, mm -hmm. and we are doing some other exercise to, to, uh, to cover the entire things that they will probably do in the industry when they, they're gonna get out of the school. Mm -hmm. And how would you say the Institute allows Haitians, especially to preserve their culture, to curate their culture, and then be able to export that to the world where they still own it? And it's still from them. It's very important for us that all the stories that we are uh, that we ask them to tell come from their own experience, their own culture, and they, that they are uh, made here. It's really important because I think th those films are going to be universal. Mm -hmm. uh, they're good, and if it's a good film and it, it, it's from an integrity creative process, it, it's gonna it's gonna work. At, on an international level. So we have uh, some exercise called Tico de la Caille, which we ask them to, 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 to tell a story about a local event or local legends. Mm -hmm. um, we, we, we also uh, try to, to, to make them uh, direct some music video mm -hmm. with local artists uh, in Jacmel or around the school. Mm -hmm. So this is the, the, the kind of thing that we, 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 we hope they're going to do. Our best short, uh, short film goes around the world. Mm -hmm. So they are selected in many film festivals around the world, and sometimes we are able to send the filmmakers or, or the producer to, to, to screen that film abroad. And also, uh, I just, I'm just thinking about two of our students, Luc Charles and Dave, they went to France to present their film, but also to, to direct a 48-hour creative filmmaking film, uh, a three-minute film, a comedy, and they, they screened it to an international audience. So they learned a lot by going uh, in other country to, to show their work and to do some film. That's great. So you're really creating a different spirit and a different energy for the Caribbean mm -hmm. film industry here. Well, listen, I don't know how much can happen in 48 hours, <laughs> but we did a lot in six yeah. minutes. <laughs> Maxence, thank you very much. You're and we welcome. look forward to seeing and screening and experiencing more Haitian film from the Institute. Thanks. Oh, merci beaucoup. <laughs> <laughs> Up next on IX. <laughs>